Hey there, YTPC. It's your boy Cosmo Cat Dad Piper. I was going to do a tobacco tasting today, but I can't find the tobacco I was going to do. So we'll save that for another time. Hopefully, I can find that. Uh, in the meantime, hopefully, you can hear me in the background. Because apparently, a neighbor is running a generator today on something. But grab yourself a pipe, grab yourself some tobacco. Let's share a pipe. I have got my uh, 320. KS Oceano 708 loaded with some Newminster 403. We'll give this a light. Let me know down below what you're smoking, what you're smoking it in. It is a beautiful afternoon. It's 62 degrees right now. It's going to get a little warmer. And for once, it's in the 60s without either 50 mile an hour winds or rain. So that is nice. Again, my apologies for the background noise. So I just got done playing some board games with a couple friends, including Eagle Talon Piper. And uh, won the first game and got the rest handed to me. And then tonight, went to a double birthday party. The other day was Mrs. Eagle Talon's birthday. And Eagle Town, his birthday is next week. So they're doing a joint party at a beer cade. So it's a bunch of video games you can play, get some beer, have some pizza. It's like a grown up Chuck E. Cheese. And no prizes. So, Newminster 403 is a great tobacco. I may or may not do a review on it at a later date, so I won't go too much detail. It takes a while to get going for me, but... As I've mentioned some of my other videos. Looking to do a live auction at some point in the near future. So one of my old pipes that I don't smoke. Bought it last fall, smoked it maybe a handful of times. Do a raffle for it, not an auction, excuse me. And then I'll use the funds from that to buy my next pipe. Should be a Peterson P lip. Man, I have a heck of a time getting this going. I can get it going, I just can't keep it going. should have dug out the pipe ahead of time to show you, but next video I'll do that. Of course it's a beautiful day and the neighbor's running a generator. I'm 
don't even know which neighbor. I'm just surrounded by the noise. I had a couple hours before I had to need to head out tonight, so I thought it'd be a good time to come out and make a video. Maybe if I take another look and find that tobacco I wanted to do a tasting of, I'll do that as well, but... It's annoying because it should be in the one box I have. Because everything else from that person is in there. And last time I smoked it was Saturday. I was like, okay, I've got enough to do a tasting because there's enough for one more bowl. So, of course, that's my luck. Sipping on some cold brew. It's mostly ice right now. Kind of on sipping on it all morning and then adding ice as the level comes down. This spring, notice on my tobacco journey, things have kind of come full circle. I'm learning how much I love the 320 again. This was the second pipe I think I bought last spring. And I'd only smoked Windjammer a couple times. That was okay. But I am really digging it this year. I'll have to go back and see if I did a review on that last year. If I didn't, I'll do a review. Otherwise, maybe I'll do a re-review. Thursday now. Don't really have a whole lot of plans for the weekend. Some adulting that I've been put off that'll get done tomorrow. Probably some crochet on Saturday. I think it's some late afternoon pipe with smoking buddy Matt on Saturday. It's uh, supposed to be in the early to mid 70s. Well, I think we're supposed to get rain then, so. I said I didn't have a whole lot to say, just wasn't planning on doing this video today, but I had to go to plan B. I could do a tobacco taste on something else, but that's the only one I kind of had prepared in my head, so. any circles, smoke rings showed up there. <sighs> One thing I did notice the other day I thought was interesting. I have some bulk old dark fire right now. Last year I just had the slices with the flakes. I think I like old dark fire best when it's the flakes and it's fresh. I 
But in terms of how slow it burns, how consistently it burns, I think the bulk is the way to go. I think it's a little bit drier, lights easier, burns very evenly. I think I got a good 50 minutes on it the other day. So I've been in at 10 minutes, which isn't long for a share pipe with me, but... I'll probably let you go. I am still enjoying this pipe, still have a ways to go. And since I'm recording and editing on my old phone, I'll have to go up on the deck where I have Wi-Fi so I can edit this. I did get a Wi-Fi extender recently from a friend. Didn't have any rules. Plugged in this morning. Apparently it's not simple as plug it in and press a button, plug and play. So I'll have to do some more research on that. But appreciate you coming and sharing a pipe with me. Hope this finds you well whenever you see it. For some reason you're watching my videos and haven't subscribed, please do so. It's it's nice. And then you can find when I do live videos. Including that raffle I'm gonna do. That's really all I had though. So as as always, thanks for watching. God bless, and we'll see you soon.